Hello everyone, welcome back. It's me Sonia from Inner Order and Joy. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can present the 45 card layout lesson to your child. This lesson, the main purpose of this lesson is to help your child understand the place value or the number placement in a very concrete way where they get to hold these golden beads and also they can visually notice the difference between ones, tens, hundreds and thousands. It also helps in um, redefining the association between the quantities and the numbers. All right. So, and also, you know what friends, this is a very big lesson in Montessori. It helps in developing their concentration uh, because they have to sit for a very long time and they have to um, do ones, tens, hundreds and thousands, both with the symbols and the materials. Friends, this is one more work where you can incorporate a lot of movement. For example, generally this, um, the tray is always sitting right next to the rug where their work area is. It will stay there. But if your child is interested in doing this 45 card layout and and if he or she needs a lot of movement, what you can do is you can put this tray, the materials across the room where they have to get up, go get the work and then work on their rug. This will also add more fun to the work. All right, guys. So let's get started with the 45 card layout lesson. All right, guys, let's start with the unit cards. Let's put them out they all are in the random fashion okay they're not in order that's fine we'll take we'll start with the quantities first this is one so where is one one this is two one two so you have to take two okay now take three beads one two Three. This is three. Now take one, two, three, four. Now you can ask your child where is four. Then if your child is interested in continuing, you can allow your child to do the rest. Like five, one, two, three, four, five. This is five. All right, guys. I have already made the nine tray with the unit beads and the nine tray with the large set of cards and how to build a large complex number as well. All the video links are in the description box below. You can check it out. Okay, let's continue. Five. What comes after five? Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. This is six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This is seven. Likewise, eight and nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So here is nine. You can ask your child what comes after nine. That is ten. Now that ten goes into the tens column. That is the next column, new column. So for this we start with the units first and then we go to the tens and then hundreds and then thousands. We always start with the quantities and then find out the symbols. Now let's go to the tens. We have to take out the tens card. Alright guys, now let's do tens. Alright, now you can ask your child what comes after 9. That is 10. So you have to take 10 bead bars out. And then this bead bar. This is 
10. This is 20. There is no place for them to put them in a vertical so I put them, I prefer to put them in a horizontal way. Let's do 20. What comes after 20? 30 10, 20, 30 Now What comes after 30? 40 10, 20, 30, 40 What comes after 40? 50 Seventy Seventy Eighty This is eighty Now ninety. Ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety. So this is ninety. All right. What comes after ninety? Your child will say hundred. That will go in the next column. All right, guys. You can ask your child what comes after ninety. Then your child will answer 100. Then you have to start from the new column. Now let's take the hundreds. So this is hundreds card. Okay. Now we are going to do. These are all not in order. So we'll take the hundred. This is 100. So you can ask your child where is 100. This is 100. Where, what comes after 100? 200. This is 200. This is 1, 2, 300. Where is 300? This is 300. I want all the, this is 100, 200, 300. What comes after 300? 400. 1, 2, 3, 400. What comes after 400? Now 1, 2, 3, 4, 500. This is 500. Now 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 600. What comes after 500? That is 600. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 700. And then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 800. And then 900 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 900 This is 900 Alright, you can let your child know what comes after 900 That is 1000, it's a big number 1,000 This is 1,000 Alright Now, what comes after 1,000? 2,000 What comes after 2,000? 1, 2, 3,000 3,000 
What comes after 3,000? 4,000. Alright guys, so I have only limited cubes, but in 45 card layout, you have 45 uh, cubes. The, those are thousands, but I have only a few, but you can show them how you can arrange until 9,000. So I'm just going to show you the symbols. 4,000, 5,000, 6,000, 7,000, 8,000, and then 9,000. All right, guys, here is the 45 card layout. Units, tens, hundreds, and thousands. This is a very big work in, Mar in Montessori. All right, guys, if you found this video helpful, uh, please hit that like button and do consider subscribing. Also, share this video with the parents or friends or family who may need this. Um, thank you so much for watching. Always stay joyful and stay humble. Bye-bye. Take care.